and welcome to my channel. My name is Cassie. Uh, thank you for joining me. I haven't sat down and actually um, done a layout in my planner in a few weeks because prior to this upcoming week I had done like five layouts in advance. Just you know sometimes inspiration strikes and you just want to sit down and do layouts. Um, so I haven't had to sit down and do one in a while. I know there's a lot going on in the world right now that kind of goes without saying and people are feeling really down and I thought it would be fun um, and you know kind of relaxing to sit down and just play with sticker books, look at next week, and kind of show you my planning style. My last video I showed you my old planning style and my planning style now is nothing like that. Clearly I have a dashboard layout now which I am absolutely in love with. It works for me. The only thing about it that I don't like, if I had to say anything, it would be the to buy section and errands. Sometimes I use these as errands and to buy, but for the most part, I don't use a to buy list. It's just not something I do, but covering that up is super easy. So it, I haven't really run into any problems. I have no clue what kind of layout I'm going to do. I'm really just not sure yet. So let's get into it. So these are by American Crafts and this is the Amy Tangerine book. I love it. I got these all, even though they're only $6.99 and I got them at um, Tuesday morning. If you have a Tuesday morning near you, ours is right next to Michael's which is really deadly for my wallet. one this week. I haven't used this one. Oh my gosh, I love these. And these are perfect for covering up the errands and the to buy. Mmm. Yeah. This might be the one. I think this this one's speaking to me. Alright. Alright, so what I like to do is choose the first sticker that I want to lay down. It's usually somewhere over here. And for the calls and emails, um, not doing as much calling and emailing lately. So I, I don't think I need a whole section for calls and emails. So I think what I'm going to do is just make this a to do list and just have this as like, or tasks or something. And then make this something else. Just not sure why yet, but we will get there. So I typically just, you know, find either a quote or a color or both that really just speaks to me in that moment. I really like the future so bright. I really like never underestimate yourself and look how it goes with that. That's like, oh my gosh, it's like an exact map. Yeah, okay. By the way, don't mind my nails. Uh, these are anxiety nails and I took the polish off and they look pretty rough. So just, uh, just ignore that. Is cut off the excess. This is um, 10 times easier with an X-Acto knife. 
or just, I mean, you know, any kind of craft knife. Doesn't have to be Exacto brand, but you know, that's like saying Kleenex for a tissue. Oily. Okay. Alright, so I cut off the top of the end, but I like it. Alright, so that's our first, because look, I wanted it at the top because I like how it, how it goes with that. Oh my god, that blue is perfect. Okay, okay. Crisis averted. We got this. Yes! Okay, I feel a lot better. See how that, okay. See how that goes with that? Okay. We're gonna be okay. I'm gonna make it through this. Sometimes it's, it's a straight struggle. Um, but we are going to make it work. This blue is actually perfect, so I'm probably going to end up using some of those in some capacity. Alright, so we want some more flowers, so I have to use this one that has the red and the orange over here somewhere. Sometimes if I, see again, this is wearing the X-Acto knife, if I want it to look like it's kind of like popping out of this, I'll just cut it, like cut a straight line. Let me just show you. If I had the X-Acto knife, this would be much easier. Just gonna cut a line there. And then, looks like it's kind of popping over there. same thing I'm going to see what angle I want this at and then cut so it has a straight edge note to self get new scissors I see I think I've had these scissors since I was a child I'm not even kidding they are old. And they're not sharp at all. See? That just makes it like a little, I don't know, it does something. Like, like, it's just, it's just cute. I love how it looks like it's popping out of the line. You know, life life can be pretty bad sometimes, but it's also beautiful. There's beauty in everything. Oh, look at that. I love it. I love that. Love it. I like that you got this, too. I'm just not sure where I want to put it. Love it. Alright, 
I'm going to go back here into my Choose Happy Mini book by the Happy Planner and find some more florals, I think. cute. I like it. Oh, do your best and forget the rest. And that's got the blue in it. Yeah, I think I'm going to have to use that somewhere. You know, this little let it go sticker, I need that right now because I am not good at letting things go. I like to just dwell on things and make myself insane. So I'm going to use this let it go sticker. Yes, love that. Love it! By the way, it is midnight right now. This is when I get inspiration. You know, it happens. <laughs> I am... Aww. My cat is meowing at me. She wants to know why I'm not petting her and going to sleep. I know. Oh, I love these little corner stickers. I wonder if there's anywhere I could use one. I, I want to use something purple because there's purple up there and I'm not using purple. Like, it just is strange. Um, well, I know I have an appointment Thursday, so I'm going to put this on Thursday just so it's like... I really hope that the mic picked up my cat meowing because that was adorable. So I'm going to lay down that sticky note and then use a sticker to hold it down. I just have to figure out which sticker I want to use. this today I think this might be cool to like put to the side like this maybe Ooh, I like that that's cute so this is my before the pen um, and I will post a picture um, of my midweek and then my after the pen because, you know, throughout the week, it sometimes it changes and I end up adding something else. But I just really like it the way it is. Um, is it my favorite spread I've ever done? No. But <laughs> I do really like it. And um, I'm glad that I found some florals that matched uh, this sticker. Because I just really like this sticker and wanted to use it. I love this blue. And then I got some blues here. And I also tied in the pink that is already, you know, on the spread. Um, or on the paper and then you've got you know some pink in the flowers and then we had the orange that we tied in with the floral so um, I really like it so what I do um, I use Google Calendar for uh, pretty much everything in my life <laughs> Google Calendar just helps me to um, keep up with especially things like recurring bills and things um, and so I will open up my Google Calendar for the week and go through and any kind of appointments, bills that are due, um, just anything, I will write it in here. So anything that, that is on there for the week, I will write it in my planner. Um, and a lot of people ask me like, why do you have Google Calendar and a planner? For me, I need to have paper and a pen to write things down, um, especially to-do lists, 
things that come up like if you're on the phone and you have to jot down an appointment I like to put that in my planner um, the Google Calendar is really just like the initial thing for me you know somebody will send you an email and say hey can we meet on this date and I'll just go ahead and put it in my Google Calendar and I put things in the Google Calendar way, of he way ahead of time and then I'll put them in my planner it helps me um, to remember appointments if I not only have them in my Google Calendar but also actually write them in here but what really helps me is having like to-do lists along with my appointments um, it's just another way for me to stay organized and to stay on top of things it's just my preference I, I find that when I you know sometimes if I go a week or two without using my planner and I'm only using my Google Calendar I feel like I feel like I don't know what's coming up th for the next week. I feel like I'm not on top of things. You know, I just don't feel like I'm put together. I just feel like I need both things. That's, you know, that's just me. Um, I also, the way I plan is for my Google Calendar, I look at the monthly view. I like to look at the entire month. But for my paper planner, I, I barely use the monthly. I like to look at it week by week in the planner. Everybody is different. Everyone has different preferences, different ways that they plan. Some people don't have an electronic calendar at all, and they just have the paper. But I just, I really need, you know, to stay on top of everything and remember everything. I need both, and that's just how I plan. So, anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed my first uh, plan with me. And the next video I do will most likely be... Um, I flipped through my current planner to show you how I set up my planner to make it work for me. So be sure to follow me on Instagram, and that's at Planning with Cass. Um, also, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Really appreciate that. Subscribe if you haven't. I'll be posting more videos. I'm going to try to post. I'm going to set a goal right now to post once a week at the least. Um, but really, it's kind of a creative outlet for me, and I love, you know sharing with you guys and hopefully um, inspiring you to you know find new ways to use your planner. I've got some video ideas um, that I'm really excited about. Isn't that sound so satisfying? Love it. <laughs> Just remember when you're decorating your planner, don't stress out about it. It shouldn't be stressful. It should be fun. It should be a creative um, outlet for you. And don't let it stress you out. And if you hate your layout for the week, sometimes you just hate your layout. And it's just the way it is. Just know that there's always next week. I do really like this one. I'm really happy with how it turned out. I love the colors and the, like, the florals with the stripes and the like paint. I just really like it. Thank you guys so much for watching and see you next time.